Hello, hello, hello. It is your favorite mom of three in NYC. Rainy, brisk NYC. Back at you with another video. Yeah! If this is your first home on my channel, welcome. Hey, my name is Teneza. I am the mother of three delightful, delightful kids living in the heart of New York City. I have a YouTube family. Always welcoming new members. All you have to do is smash the button that says subscribe. All right, I'll go ahead and sing. S-U-B-S-C-R-I-B-E. S-U-B-S-C-R-I-B-E. Subscribe down below. Come eat with me. Appointment on the Upper West Side. And I had every intention. I planned my meals out ahead of time. It's me, I'm guilty. I like to see what's in the area. What do I have a taste for? And so Teneza knew that, oh, I'm so sorry, my manners. If you are already subscribed to my channel, thank you for the support, I appreciate you. Please make sure that you turn on your notifications so that every time I post, you get the alert. All right, back to food. So I'm a big fan of Levain Bakery. I will drop the review for that cookie below. And I had every intention on going to the location. I believe it's on 74th Street. But I decided to get Mexican food for lunch. And right next to the restaurant that I did pick up was a bakery. I All right. You guys know I love my baked goods. I'm here on the Upper West Side. Usually I do go to Levain Bakery. But I thought I would try out Chip City for my dessert today, yes. I'd never heard of them. Chip City. I said, self, this is the year of trying new things. I think Daniel Tiger. <laughs> All three of my kids love Daniel Tiger on PBS. So Daniel Tiger is a offshoot of Mr. Rogers Neighborhood for those that don't have kids and so, or small kids in their lives. And so he says, try new things because they might taste good. I've been saying that for 10 years now. Try new things because they might taste good. I said, self, let's just try her out. And so I went on, before I went inside, I got on their webpage and I had picked out the flavor that I wanted to try. When I went in, they did not have that flavor. According, I think her name is Latoya. I, I hope I hope it is. It's love. I was so focused on the cookies. I had in my mind that I wanted a brookie. That's what I want. I want a brookie. It was described as a brownie cookie combination. But when I went into the shop, she said they change flavors every Friday. So they may have it this Friday, but they did not have it currently. And so I asked, I, I have really been on this kick asking the barista, the associate, what do they recommend? What's amazing, triple chocolate. So every Friday you said we change. Uh... And so she recommended this Nutella cookie. And I was like, er, that's there's a filling inside, right? I was like, er, I'm on my cycle. I'm really craving chocolate. She's like, well, if you want to go boring, the chocolate chip, it's milk chocolate chip. It's not the dark chocolate. She loves the dark chocolate chip, but they don't have that this week, only the milk chocolate. But they did have a triple chocolate. And so your girl, I never get like two desserts, but I'm just YOLO. Oh, it's warm. I got the triple chocolate cookie. I feel like, I'm an adult though, I'm grown. And it's the Nutella cookie. According to Latoya, I hope her name is, it's her very favorite cookie. And so I said, I'm gonna try it. Let's do it. let's do this. I'm going to try them on camera. Again, Chip City, it's on Columbus between 77th and 78th. I'll go ahead and put the website right here for you guys. It's got like a salted, it's like a salted caramel Nutella cookie with sea salt on top. Should I put this on? I should put it on camera for you guys. It's heavy. It's definitely at least a pound. It feels like that. Ooh. Inside. Mm. 
Wow. Wow. It's really good. Really good. It's really good. I myself have never been in a crumble. I have had crumble cookies and that's kind of the vibe that I was getting. Rotating flavors, huge cookies. That's really good, you guys. Really tasty. Wow. Oh, wait. The filling is right there. Wow. I thought I had the filling right there, but no. Wow. Mmm. Wow. Look at that pull of Nutella. Wow. That's the filling. It's like buttery. It's so good, you guys. Definitely a savory cooked with the salt. Wow. And Nutella. Very buttery. So I love butter, so I'm here for it. This is delicious. Delicious. Like I mentioned, it's not your conventional like cookie, like flat cookie. It's more of a cakey, super thick and rich. It's good. Really good. Wow. Solid four out of five stars. Solid. So good, you guys. So she initially recommended s'mores s'mores cookie she said her favorite was this nutella yes but since i went in there for chocolate so i'm debating a four and a half of that guy she said this one has all the chocolate chips the milk chocolate dark chocolate and white chocolate i should drink some water cleanse my palate so it's a pure tasting Wow. That cookie was delicious, you guys. Triple chocolate. It's good. I'm like a brownie, though. It's like a cookie crust. Definitely dark chocolate, not milk. It's good. It's tasty. How huge is that? Wild, right? It's very good. This guy's a four. Four. This Nutella though, I am so glad that she recommended this. This right here, 4.8. Trying to think, what's, the, what's my favorite perfect cookie of all time that would get a five? I can't even think of one right now. This cookie right here has all my attention. It's a 4.8. I can't think of what's perfect though. Like what's not making it a five? Am I scared of giving the highest score away? They deserve it. They have to. It's so good, you guys. <gasps> and then somehow it's still warm. I don't understand it. Cookie magic. I don't get it. It's so good, you guys. Growing up, the extent of my, like, cookie palette was Mrs. Fields in Potomac Mills Mall. They had a milk chocolate. They had a dark chocolate cookie. But my favorite was their brownies. Their chocolate chocolate chip brownies. So good. Definitely a must try, you guys. I think they're here to give Crumble a run for their money. And I actually prefer this over Crumble. 100%. Sometimes... 
I'm not a fan of crumble cookies. I feel like there's so much sugar in them. They don't really have a lot of flavor or taste. They're just sugar. Not this guy right here. Mm -mm. The ingredients are awesome. They're definitely here to give crumble a run for their money. Similar concept, in my opinion, very similar concept. But in terms of the taste of this, I may have to go to five. I started at 4.5. <laughs> 4.8 I'm gonna have to it's really there's nothing I would change unfortunately it's just it's amazing it's amazing mm. it's amazing it understood the assignment so good it's a lot of butter but they do have vegan options. I think instead of egg, they use coconut oil. And there's no dairy, they use oat milk. And since BB2 is dairy free, that gives us a nice option for him too. So good. I'm full right now, but I'm gonna finish the cookie. In fact, it's a five, it's a five. It's a five. Nice crunch of the nut. I love the taste of the sea salt on top. The Nutella is perfection. Five. Five out of five. And definitely, mouth feels great. Decadent. Decadent. That's how I would describe this. Decadent. A gourmet cookie almost. Mm, mm, mm. Delicious. Five out of five. The triple chocolate was good as well, but this guy has the crown. Chip City. First time seeing them, hearing about them. They've got a few locations in New York and DC, I believe. But it's worth a try. All right, tribe. Have an amazing. What's your favorite cookie? Comments below. What is your favorite five out of five star cookie? Let me know in the comments below. Have an amazing rest of your day, and I'll see you in our next video. Bye, tribe.